One of the best periods inside my life were the times where I actually fasted for multiple days in a row. So now you may be thinking, Bro, you're stupid. Why are you starving yourself to death? Well, let me tell you, bro. I didn't even felt hungry that how depressed or bored. I literally felt in the zone the entire time. So my goal with this video is to transfer the knowledge that I have actually learned through intermittent fasting and through all of the other experiences that I have learned about stoicism. Because while I did this, not only did I not act upon my emotions even though I felt them, but I even discovered something very special that you must hear. Literally, so far, you have the brain, which is already good. You have your own brain, your own conscious mind. But what if I told you that there is something even bigger? Your conscious mind is literally like only 5% of what you literally have inside your mind. Inside this video, bro, I will tell you literally the key to unlocking the door for you to actually control the other hidden part of your brain, which is far, far, far more capable than the one you currently think with. So, first of all, brother, we need to live with God as our priority. That is how you kind of become stoic in basically every way inside your life. There are basically two choices that you currently have. You can either live by the stomach and eat whenever you want, or you can actually follow God and eat whenever He wants. So basically, whenever you do it for somebody else, you are far more likely to do it. Just imagine right now you had a ch child, or simply imagine somebody you very, very much love dearly. And if they were in danger, you probably wouldn't just sit around here and think, oh man, they will save themselves. You would probably go there and rush and literally help them out as much and as soon as possible, even sacrifice your own life for their sake. So that is exactly what God is whenever you start to believe in Him. But whenever you start to believe in yourself, you start going by the stomach. Whenever you sit down to eat, all you can think about is the food in front of you, the carbohydrates, the sugars. You see the meat and you, you reject it. You go for the sugars, you go for the bread, you go for every single thing that is actually bad for you. And then out of a sudden, here you are, sick got some pills from the doctor and they said that you should that you shouldn't eat any more cholesterol because it's bad for you and all of that if that's the case brother they are literally telling you to stop being a man so that is what you exactly get whenever you go by the stomach so screw that over bro and go and follow god i'm not telling you that you should be particularly be a muslim a christian a hindu or something just Find God and believe in Him. That's all you have to do to literally just construct your life for the success. Second thing, brother, as I said, do intermittent fasting if you can for longer periods of time. So, the way that the subconscious mind serves you is on insane level, bro. You cannot even comprehend. Let me tell you about it first. So, the subconscious mind, imagine it as an ocean of knowledge. Every single time you read a book, it's like literally you take, I don't know, 30 liters of knowledge and you spill it inside the ocean. And you fill up this ocean, you fill it up, you fill it up, you fill it up until it's so big and so deep that it is kind of even scary to look at it. It's scary to look at it. It's scary to look at your own knowledge. You're scary because of how smart you are. Just think about how crazy that sounds. And this knowledge, bro, is so much bigger than your conscious part of the brain. The conscious part of the brain, imagine it like a little bucket of water. And then just imagine the entire Pacific, Indian, I don't know, every ocean that you can imagine on this earth. Just imagine all of that compared to that one little bucket. This little bucket fills up the ocean, but you cannot actually use the ocean if you eat carbohydrates every single day, if you do not allow your brain to recover. Literally, even the carnivore diet is to some extent bad for you whenever you try to think. The most business success that I have ever had inside my life were those days where I would fast morning till night and eat at night. And recently, brother, I have fasted for two days straight without eating anything. On the second day, bro, I literally was in the zone the entire time and could even make plans for everything. Right now, bro, I have an entire business plan for this month, which will probably make me a ton of money simply because 
I'm doing something that unlocks my, uh, my subconscious mind, that ocean of knowledge. So how do you unlock this? As I said, bro, just quit eating for a little while. You can eat whatever you want, fair enough, but at least go on and try to fast for morning till night every single day. Or if you can't even do that, bro, at least switch to the carnivore diet because meat is far healthier than other stuff for you. It gives you far less brain fog. You know the times when you are, whenever you feel dizzy and sleepy after you ate an entire bubble of pasta or rice? That's exactly due to that, due to the carbs, because they are so hard for your body to process. So at least eat something easy, like eggs, fat, and other protein sourced meats. That's all you have to do. So how will this help you out? Well, it will get you status, it will get you relationships, it will get you everything, even health. How? You start going to the gym, you start making far more progress, you start going cold approaching girls, and you make more progress inside relationships, you start sharing stories with people, you start actually acting like a human being for once, and out of a sudden you're not scared anymore of anything. Everything that you can imagine, bro, social life, friends, health, whatever you think, whatever you name it, this subconscious mind will help you out with that. And it's just a sad thing that after you know this knowledge right now, you just decide to click off this video and continue your own ways still, even though you know that they did not make you successful and they never will. You wouldn't be watching this video right now if you were happy with your life, if you honestly had everything that you ever wanted inside your life. You probably lack something inside your life. Maybe it's money, maybe it's relationships, maybe you're alone, fuck bro. Maybe you're alone, fuck. Just go and do something about this bro. And the first step is to literally unlock your brain for once. That's all you have to do. Let's move on to the third thing, bro. This one is a very important one. Find your purpose. Basically, separate people into two positions, at least from my perspective. You see, there are two kinds of people. What the first one is the, pe the person that actually just wakes up in the morning whenever he wants, after who whatever amount of sleep he had, and he just goes on, eats, first thing in the morning. He doesn't brush his teeth. He doesn't even take proper hygiene of himself. He is taking a shower every once or every one or two weeks. He is literally that disgusting, bro. And this guy barely survives. His body is, a con is in a constant fight, fight of bacteria and all of that, of diseases. And this guy just continues to do that. He drinks alcohol, he goes ahead and gets poor sleep, he wakes up and goes to bed whenever he wants. He goes works a 9 to 5 job, he hates his life, but he continues to do the same old ways. And then you have this new, other, second guy. This guy bro, he wakes up at the same time every single day, he goes to the gym at the same time every single day of his life. He holds to a schedule and he has a purpose. Something that he, something that means to him far more than himself and his own son. Imagine that, something even more important than your own family. Well, this is the thing, bro. This is the thing that you need to discover inside your life because this is the thing that will allow you to have that beautiful family you always wanted. What is it? Purpose. Find something that will literally contribute to the entire humanity, not just your entire family or yourself. Don't be that selfish. You have the knowledge, you have the willpower, you have the brain to literally help out so many people and save them. Literally, your work can literally save somebody from suicide every single day. Imagine what impact you will be making whenever you follow this purpose. That's what you need to find your, inside your life. That's what has allowed me to become this person that I'm currently at. That's why I'm so riled up about speaking with this right now. That's why. Because it's my purpose to help you out. It's my purpose. It's my duty on this world to find you to help you out and put you on the right path. Because I have been in the wrongs, bro. I have been that corner spider inside the classroom, never knowing what to say anything to a guy, let alone speak to a girl. I have been that guy who was so insecure in his body that he couldn't even flex his bicep, but now I have become this thing over here. That's why 
because it was my purpose. So find your purpose, bro. If you get anything out of this video, just forget about the first two things. Forget about living for God. Forget about intermittent fasting. Forget about all of that. Just find your purpose, bro, and you will do yourself so much favor. Because from your purpose, everything else will manifest. Intermittent fasting, friends, social life success, following God. Everything will just come from your own purpose. But until you find this thing, you will be this guy who believes everything that he sees by his doctors and all of that. So, brother. Find your purpose. Find it right now. I won't bore you with the details as to how to find that, bro. All you can do is just ask yourself, what did I enjoy doing or what would I enjoy doing for 20 hours a day for the next 20 years without getting paid and I wouldn't get bored? What would I enjoy doing that would be so fun that I would do it for that amount of time without getting bored out of my mind? Just think about that thing and then everything else will follow. And to be honest, bro, that is the reason why I'm recording this video. I'm so grateful that I have found this purpose. I'm grateful to God that I have found this thing that I can help you out with. I'm grateful that I have become this person, this person of character, this person who improves in say life, this person who is there to help out other people, who doesn't live for himself alone, who lives for others as well. And they wouldn't have been here without God's help and my purpose. So. I cannot stress this enough, bro. Find your purpose and become somebody who will contribute to the entire society, not just your family. Thanks all for watching, brother. And if you are curious, bro, you can go ahead and join my free school community. It's called The Growth. It's the first link in the description and we will see you inside there. Bye-bye.